Hello everyone and welcome to the second part of this video. We have finally finished this two bedroom refurbishment and I'm going to walk you around and show you everything that has been done here. Testing out the GoPro. So here is the kitchen. If you look at the last video, if you haven't already seen it, there used to be a wall that came just along there and then returned back in. So we took that wall out to create the open plan kitchen living space, as you can see. So in this kitchen, it's quite compact, but we've managed to fit in all appliances. So we've got washing machine dryer here. We've got dishwasher, other side of these two units, which are just storage underneath the sink. Um, you've got an oven with hob above, extractor, fridge freezer, and you've got your built-in microwave. So everything that you need. Come take a closer look at the finish of what we've actually gone for here. So this is quartz, quartz worktop, similar to, it looks like marble, it's not marble, but it's, it's very similar. Um, really, really nice finish. And the client went for ceramic sink. These are beautiful, but you just have to be very, very careful with them because they're easily marked. Went for the screwless sockets. We've got one USB here in the kitchen and then the rest are just normal. These are really nice and modern, look perfect. Let's go and take a look around the rest of the property. So you, as you can see here, this is solid oak wood flooring. Um, what we had to do with the whole of this floor was put 12 mil ply across the whole floor, plug and screw every single board, and then this went on the top of that. And this is secret nailed every single board. Really, really nice. Another cool feature, which I have actually missed, you've got smart lighting in this property. If you don't know what smart lighting is, so we've got the lights as you walk in and the kitchen lights. These can actually be controlled via an app, via your phone, device, it doesn't matter where you are. You could be on the train on the way home from work and you can turn the lights on in the kitchen. Um, and we've got a similar system for the alarm, which is great. This is where the TV is going to go, up here. Sofa's gonna probably be around here. Um, and then a the little sort of dining room table, probably situated around here. Nice bit of storage underneath the stairs. Client has opted for a little wine fridge and another freezer. So really utilizing the space that's there. If you have a look at the last video, you'll see what these stairs used to look like. These have come out really nice. Um, went for a stained finish, so they all had to be sanded down, filled, sanded quite a few times to be honest. Um, and then this is about three coats of stain. Great colours that the client has also opted for. You've got Tranquil Dawn, which brings you all the way down the stairs. And that colour is also used in the bedrooms where the headboards will be going. Here's your bathroom. This here is the underfloor heating thermostat, which is just all here. So even though this bathroom is quite small, the space has been utilized very well. And it looks really nice to be honest. Fully tiled, 
underfloor heating, nice blinds that I've been put in here, which match the whole property with the pelmet that comes across the top. Bedroom one, as we come through here, so we haven't got any furniture in here yet, but the bed will be going here. So you have the sockets either side of the bed. You actually see in the next bedroom, the bed has gone in. And that's where the TV will be going on the wall. These heaters, um, these can also be connected from your phone to a device and you can control them anywhere you are as long as you've got internet. This storage cupboard which has been utilised to the max. So you've got two little shelves down there and then a shelf at the top with a hanging rail. This before um, used to start I think it was about 400 up from the floor and the way this whole flat used to be heated was warm air was blasted from downstairs and then it came out of the cupboards and you had vents in this room and in the other room which um, heated the whole property so we took all of that out these were oak veneer doors which were painted white they looked great before they were painted, but they actually look even better now. Matching switches throughout the whole property. Screwless. This is the, where the water cylinder is. This is what heats the hot water throughout and you've got a little bit of storage up here. And for the second bedroom, as you can see, we put the bed in, socket on this side and on the other side. And I'm sure TVs will be going up very soon in both bedrooms and downstairs. This cupboard is uh, exactly the same as next door with the three shelves and hanging rail. So I hope you like this video. Um, if you haven't seen the first one, go and check that one out and don't forget to like, subscribe, and I'm going to try to do a lot more content around refurbishments um, and other projects that are currently on the go at the moment. Take care.